welcome back to that dad guy. It's a different room. It's pretty echoey. Uh, yeah, we're in the bathroom. Yeah, not for what you think. I think spring is coming. I think it's time to get rid of this beard. And I know there are a few of you out there like the sound of sounds. So I figured I might as well give it a go. And you might like to see what uh, this winter beard looks like when it's all done. And uh, maybe the, the process in between. So what am I going to use? I'm going to use this razor. It's a nice wall. Uh, it has an attachment on it, which is attachment number uh, one. So that is what we're going to shave down to on some parts. And then the rest, uh, we're going to get rid of it completely. And then I will tidy up my head like I do too. So I figured I'd bring you along. Let's get at this. No turning back now. We're doing a nice strip through there. What do you think? Already got a big chunk of it gone, but you can see how thick that hair has gotten. I've got a cape on, not because I am a superhero, but I am going to catch all this. So there, I can keep a big uh, sideburn. I used to have sideburns when I was younger. Not that I probably will keep it, but hey, let's have some fun. This is coming off in huge chunks. Now, why am I doing it now? Well, it is starting to get a little warmer out. There. Kind of an odd look. I don't like the sideburns. We're getting rid of those. Valentine's Day is coming up. So let's uh, tidy up a little bit. Valentine's Day is also my wife's birthday. Look, we still have all this down here. So let's clean up the neck a little bit. I was having people on my live say, oh, it's a manly beard. Well, maybe, but it's just a beard. Now we got a heavy goatee going on here now. Am I starting to look a little younger? Let's do this. Get rid of this part. Clean up the back. I like the sound of that razor going through all this hair. The downside of looking down while I'm doing the top of my head is that I see all the gray and the white that I've, I guess I deserve. I've worked hard to get it. But it's coming off. So you might have asked, how long have I grown this beard for? Well, I started at the start of December. I grow up for winter when I'm out at work. So that was about uh, a little over two months worth of growth. Clean up that nice. Get up the back of my neck here. Love this cape, it catches so much of the hair so I don't have it all over my sink. All right, now I did show you. There, it's a little tidier already. There's some spots back there I know I gotta hit again. Let's just do that real quick here. It is a hard thing shaving your head when you can't see what you're doing on the back. So I often have to go to my wife and say, did I miss any spots? And sure enough, I usually have. So there, the dome is done again. Check back there. Oh, I can see a big spot I missed right at the edge. Hidden behind the ear. Did I miss on this side too? It not look like I did. All right, getting there, but not quite done yet. This is too long, it's more than I want to keep. So this is where I put the number one on, throw that on there all. Right up the center.
So he could leave a beard like or a mustache like that. No, we're not going to. Or could have half a mustache. I can tell you, I don't miss paying for the barber to clean my head and uh, cut it back and do styles and all the rest. I can do it myself in this amount of time. So I've gone from two months worth of growth down to that. All right, but I'm not done yet. Let's, uh, let's do one thing first. Why don't we tidy up a little bit with a little shaving cream. Then we'll give it a little lather. You might be thinking, this isn't post crossing, this isn't stamps. You're right, it's not. And I am not limiting myself to just doing that. I like to do a variety of things. And if you're gonna grow a beard for two months, why not take advantage and uh, make a video about shaving it off? Hey, maybe somebody out there uh, is just learning how to shave. And this is a video that you just can do it. I don't know. You certainly have to make the skin a little tighter. Before I use this blade, I make sure I use the uh, wall and get off the long hairs first. Last thing I want to do is pull those hairs out. Are you starting to see a transformation? I know I'm already feeling a little bit lighter. Clean up that goatee. You can see it's still there. I like to polish down the dome a little bit there. All right, that part's done. What do you think? Does it look better? Well, here's hoping the groundhog was right and that spring is on its way soon. I know looking ahead in the forecast, we might still get a bit of snow, especially next week. I see a little bit in our forecast. Everything's subject to change. But on the weekend, we're going to have plus temperatures and maybe it will melt some of the snow we already have on the ground. Uh, so I'm going with a fresh spring look to get ready for spring already and to be uh, a little bit more youthful. Doesn't this face look a little more useful, youthful than the last one and uh, not as much gray as visible here too. Now I can work on losing the weight and getting a little bit of less of uh, these cheeks going and uh, get back into a fitness routine again. Well, hopefully you enjoyed uh, hearing the sounds of shaving. Uh, maybe you learned a tip or two if you're not into shaving yet. And uh, if not, hey, it's just fun. I had fun, hopefully you did too. Have a magical week. Like, follow? You say like, subscribe, share, and tell all your friends. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy?